Distance learning may work for some, but it's definitely not the solution for everybody. And that's social interaction, being with other people, uh, learning firsthand from a teacher, being able to work and tutor each other. That's vital for our kids' development. Hey everyone, it's State Rep Tom Morrison, and I am joined by a colleague, Representative Joe Sosnowski. You also filed a resolution on the reopening of schools. Yes. And again, that's just an encouragement to um, school boards and the state to collaborate, and what can we do to get students back in school full time? And so, uh, you know, our district is in the northwest suburbs of Cook County. Joe, you're up in Rockford. You know, what's the sentiment of parents and others? You know, this is intended to give parents and families the choice. If you feel comfortable or there's issues with family health and you want to keep students home, you know, that's, that should be a parent decision. So, we'll, you know, we should offer remote learning, but and when the pandemic started, I think everybody was concerned, you know, you wanted to be over precautious. But as the months went on, we realized that, you know, how to have safeguards. And, you know, you mentioned coming from Rockford, we've got 30,000 students in our public school system there, and they're one of the only public schools uh, that have had in-person learning since September. Mm -hmm. We've had thousands of private school students in, in my community uh, have been in-person five days a week. And in, in both cases, uh, both public and private, uh, you've seen no spread in the classroom. Uh, they've taken precautions by separating and, and wearing masks in the classroom when they're close together. And there's been a handful of students that you know have been uh, uh, tested and diagnosed with it. Uh, you know they do co proper quarantining, and again there's been no issues. Uh, and in fact, our uh, you know we were at a point where our community had 15% positivity based hmm. off of testing. And if you looked at the entire student body, including teachers, uh, we were less than 1% the entire time. And that's just a testament to the fact that schools can be safe. We need to get our kids back in learning. Uh, distance learning may work for some, but it's definitely not the solution for everybody. And that's social interaction, being with other people, uh, learning firsthand from a teacher, being able to work and tutor each other. That's vital for our kids' development. So we need right. to give parents the choice, and we need to do that sooner than later. Joe, Thank thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me.